All right, so today we're going to be replacing a headlight. Now, on this car, we have this headlight that's out. The other one over here works just fine, which is good because if you're on this side, you have to take the battery out of the way, which is a big pain in the butt. But however, we are on this side, so should be much easier not take too long here. So the first step is there's this plastic cap behind the bulb here. This cap right here, and that's just going to simply twist out. It's kind of a tight fit with your hand with this in the way, but it can happen. Uh, sometimes a little tight. I wiggle back and forth sometimes. But just go ahead and twist and then pull that out. And then once you have it all the way rotated, it just kind of pulls out then. So there's that cap removed. And then back in here, we can see our uh, the back of our light. It's important to note that there is this uh, metal piece here at the tip of my finger, and this gets pushed down, and that's what's able to then release it so you can pull the old one up. So I pushed that down and wiggled on it a little bit, and it all came loose. So now you can go ahead and just... Wiggle this light out of here a little bit. Red wire's stuck on that piece of metal there. A little over the top. Wiggle, wiggle. All right. Here we go. Alright, here's the old burnt out light. And then this can just get detached from the black back piece there. And you can just pull it right off of that. It should just snap off, snap in. Alright, old bulbs out. Here's my super cheap replacement bulb that we're going to now put in. And it's going to go in the exact opposite way. So this is just going to then get pushed into the end of that black metal piece. And then it's going to be reassembled the way we disassembled it. All right, so the way this is shaped, it only fits in there one way. Um, you can remember the way you take it out, otherwise it's easy to just look, and it only fits in there one way. And there's a piece that, that sticks out here on the place where the bulb goes in, so it has to go in this way. It's also where these holes line up with the other holes. So we're gonna go ahead and snap this in here. Try not to touch the glass of the bulb with your fingers too much, if you can avoid it. And then that's in there. And then we'll go ahead and just push that through our hole here. Alright, so it's back in there and then this was the piece that we popped loose before. You're just going to have to push that down and around here to lock your new bulb in place. 